After five days of combing through the rubble, the search and rescue team comprising of, among others, KDF soldiers called off the search, putting the final death toll at eight, while two of the 43 injured are yet to be discharged from hospital. Kisi County Commissioner Kulahache at the county government to waive the hospital and post-mortem bills for the affected families. At the same time, she appealed to the county administration to cater for the transportation costs for the bodies of those killed during the tragedy. Investigation will be done on the drawing of the building, on the approval of the building, and everything which was done before the building was constructed and what happened after that. I think a tragedy is a tragedy and we need to handle it in that manner. What we would have expected him to tell the national government and the, the, and, uh, and the national assembly is the process that the national government is doing to apprehend the, whoever was putting up that structure. That man had architects, he had engineers, he had all those manner of people. The National Construction Authority has since revealed the owner of the collapsed building flaunted the law by constructing an additional seven floors, whereas his building plans show he was authorized to construct three floors. For members to direct the development comes as the Cabinet Secretary for Transport and Infrastructure, James Masharia, was at pains to explain to the National Assembly Committee on Transport and Infrastructures measures in place to curb such disasters. Communication with the Minister of Interior, uh, requesting them to arrest this particular developer. That we shall provide to you. Yes. Um, secondly, uh, you know there is a criminal negligence here. It is not just a developer which is involved. We have professionals called architects, yeah, yes. we have engineers, yes. we have QSs, yes. uh, and the contractors who are actually now registered at the NCA. What we have to do, and we discussed this earlier with my team, we have to make sure that these professional bodies who reg which register these people, <coughs> deregister these particular individuals. Every Tuesday we actually meet to re-strategize. So we ask ourselves, how much have we done now? What, how else we can we do? How else can we do better than what we are doing now? Eh? And one of the units which is with us is actually the National Disaster Unit. They are part of our team, and uh, we have the best team that we can. The thing, the issue is resources. His explanation failed to convince the committee that the government has a solid plan, prompting the committee to order him to appear next week on Tuesday with a satisfactory answer. And, and you come with a comprehensive document. You have just said it's only Nairobi, but, but we want you to other areas. Don't, don't, don't just zero in on Nairobi. We want, you have seen people have uh, died in Ikisi, and yet... Uh, you have that mandate. Uh, are, are we in agreement, uh, madam? And that should be done on Tuesday so that this matter of Kisi doesn't die. This matter will not die until you people are taken to court. And whoever doesn't do his job will be summoned by this committee. Masharia attributed the increase in collapsed buildings to contravention of the law. Brenda Kiprono reporting for Channel 1 News Hour.